How's it going, YouTube fanatics from all around the world? I hope you're having a merry, merry, wonderful Christmas. I am sorry that my upload schedule is weird. I keep forgetting and I don't have that many decks because I don't got that much money. So, yeah, today I got something special for you. My teammate, homie, Arby, hooked it up with Christmas presents, okay? And he knew what I liked and he bought me one of the Yugi's Collector's box and a Circuit Break Special Edition. So for you guys, I'm going to unbox them, alright? Hopefully you guys got what you guys wanted for um, your Yu-Gi-Oh! needs for this Christmas. Guys and girls, you know, there's female players for sure. So without further ado, let's unbox this and shout out so much to RV for getting this for me for Christmas. Um, let's start off with the Circuit Break Special Edition. Let's put Yu-Gi in there. Inside. So with this special edition, you can get um, a Wing Dragon Ross Sphere Mode or a Stardust Chronicle Dragon, I think, from the Shonen Jump, and two cards from Extreme Rules, Extreme Force, Extreme Rules, some WWE stuff right there, right? All right, so he taped that right there. In the front, we have Borolo Dragon as the main cover card. Yeah, I can just rip it off, right? Yeah. So how's your guys' how's everyone's Christmas going so far? Um, mine's pretty good. I got stuff I wanted, and I got people things they wanted. So it was all good for both ends. So let's see what we can get. Let's open it and let's hope for a Wind Dragon of Ross Sphere Mode because that card is the card to get in the special this version of the special editions. Put that on the side, aka the floor. Boom! Stardust Chronicle Spark Dragon and Parallel Port Armor. So, that's cool. I don't know anything about Cyber stuff or Link stuff. Well, I do know Link stuff, but I don't focus on it. So, I'll put that right there. Let's get going. Hopefully, we'll, we pull a secret rare. Because the, the new ratio is um, you get a hollow per pack. So, hopefully, I just get a secret rare. Or an ultra rare. A good ultra rare. Maybe, I don't know. Crawler Gael. Amazonas Pet Tiger, FA Whip Crosser, sorry for the glare, Ednishna Ket Rocket Dragon, and a Metaphys Ragnarok, that's a super, and a Twin Triangle Dragon for a rare, and these. So yeah, I am being summoned, but we'll wait on that. Second pack. Um... For you guys who play Metaphys, how's that deck? Like, what do you need to make that deck run? Please leave it in the comments and let me know. Because I'm kind of interested in making it. You got a da duck dummy. This artwork is pretty cool. Uh, the Accumulator. Crawler Spine. World Legacy Clash. Actually, I probably have a Crawler deck profile coming up shortly, so yeah. And uh, Alter Guys Prima Banshee. An Ultra Rare. And for the rare is one time passcode. That's pretty cool. Got an ultra rare. Cool, cool. And Metaphys Factor, Medica, Phantom Beast, Raitlin, and Vendred Sturgis. Last pack. What can we get? Can we end with a secret rare? We and we had an ultra rare last time in the ultra disc from Banshee, but I want more. Hashtag greediness. Link restart. I like this card. This might be useful. Crawler Spine. Temple of the Mind's Eye. Any battle damage a player takes becomes 1,000. Okay. Vendred Knights is the Hollow. Okay. And the rare is the Altar Geist Camouflage. I did not end up with a secret rare. But, um... It can happen. Because I remember I bought, uh, two... Super, uh, special editions last week. And I pulled two quick draws. I wanted bore load. I needed more bore loads, but yeah. Let's put that over here, this corner, while I open Yugi's Legendary Collector's Box. This is cool. We got, um, let, let me open the packaging. It's that easy. Just pop a hole. There's, it's basically an open window, so. People make it try to make it fancy and stuff. I'm not. Nah, I'm gonna pop a hole right in the middle and just open it. Uh, Yugi's collector's box. So what this has? Let's check in the back. Sorry, I had to go all the way around. It has believe in the heart of the cards. 
Um, Dark Magician, giant-ish card, larger card, and a starter deck Yugi Reloaded, um, and a tiny ultra rare version of the Dark Magician, and three duelist packs, one Yugi and one Kaiba. So let's see what we can get. I haven't opened a duelist pack before, but I remember Garrett, another Yu-Gi-Oh friend of mine before he retired and quit the game, um, bought a box of these two packs and he got pretty good stuff. So hopefully I can too. Uh, let's review. Whoa. What the heck? Okay. So we got the star deck reloaded. We'll look at that lit first. Then we got this cool promo. Ultra Ray Dark Magician. This artwork. This artwork is beautiful. And big A Dark Magician. Oh. This card, not, this card cannot be used in a duel. Why not? Can it, can it be a field center or something? Look at this. This is beautiful. Boom. Field center. Let's put that down below. Uh, the three packs. Duelist pack Yugi. Duelist pack Kaiba. Alright. Let's start with the starter deck reloaded because um, these cards are best, pretty much guaranteed. I wonder why there's no like Gorgekis in these starter decks, you know? I mean, I know it's a starter deck, but... They use Regeki a lot, right? Why not? I'm just destroying this thing. Oh, this is the one that comes with the ulti Dark Magician. That's cool. We got um, power up uh, power up the starter deck. Field zones, paper. This doesn't matter anymore because of Link Summoning. Well, it could, it could work. If no one knows how to play the game, I'll just give that to them so they know. They suggested it. So we're gonna start again. Ultimate Rare Dark Magician. This is pretty cool. Let's open this. Let's run through this real quick. The hollows are Dark Magician, Ultimate Rare. You don't see Ultimate Prince anymore. And the Dark Magician, Dark Magician. Let's go, oh, Giant Soldier, Stone, Summon Skull. So basically, all those cards that Yugi used uh, in his bout in Duel Monsters, they will cast on. Gadget, that's cool. Electric virus, this card's pretty cool. The tricky, I like the card. A dark hole, MST, mage power, book of moon, dark magical attack, ancient rolls. Ancient rolls is really good. Um, shard of greed, mirror force. I've never opened one of these before, so yeah, zero gravity. So yeah, that's that. It's a quick review. Put that right here. I'm gonna put this up here. Yeah, and here we go. Let's do one of each, so let's go cut. So Yugi first. Um, hopefully I pull a Dark Paladin. I don't know. It's the card right there, right? Or a Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. Or end up, or at least get a Hollow. Get a Hollow. King's Knight. Yellow Gadget. Soldier Revealing Light. Jack's Knight. And Marshmallow on. Marshmallow on. That card's like really trolly. Alright, for Kaiba now. Where are we at? Eight minutes. Any faster than I usually do. Saggy, the Dark Clown. Ring of Defense. Familiar Knight. Hatsumi Giant. And Paladin White Dragon. That card's good. I remember um, there's a White Dragon version of Blue Eyes that was running it, I think. I don't know. I was looking at it for a while. I'm like, oh, I need that card. But I don't need it. So, yeah, um,. Please let me know if you guys like Yugi or Kaiba better. For me, I'm a personal Kaiba fan. I never really like Yugi. Catapult Turtle. Light Force Sword. Diffusion Wave Motion. Mirror Force! Ooh! Ultra Rare. And Exchange. Cool. I got a Hollow. Mirror Force. That's cool. That's in the Yugi one. Hopefully Kaiba will also give me a card that I seek. White Dragon Ritual for the Paladin. Cool. Lord of D. Ring of Defense. White Stone of Legend. Super rare. Ooh. And Cost Down. This card's nice. White Stone of Legend. Okay. 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 For you Blue Eyes fans out there, I think my friend Gabe might want one. Because, you know, he might need two. You know what I mean? Diffusion Wave Motion. This is the last Yugi pack. Let's see what we can get. Swords of Revealing Light. Karibo! Yugi's um, 
friend, best friend. Cannibal Turtle and the Hollow is Dark Magician. Like there's no Hollow. It's a rare. All right, last pack. Let's see what we can get, guys and girls. Heart of the cards, guide me. Hashtag bless my pulls. I might have a deck profile ready, actually. I'll see. And once again, thank you, Arby, for picking this up for me for Christmas. I appreciate it. And here's my polls if you ever get the chance to watch this. Hatsumi Giant. Ancient Lamp. Sagi, the Dark Clown. Polarization. And Vampire Lord as the final card. Vampire Lord. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, White Sun of Legend. Super is cool. The Mirror Force. Always good. Exchange. Cost down. Dark Magician. The Prima Banshee from the Special Edition. All pretty good. I am very happy with these polls. Hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this video. And Merry Christmas to all of you. Um, stay tuned for my next video. Deck profile. I don't know what I'm going to do. But yeah. If you do follow my page. You see me upload my Fortnite video. So... This might be a hybrid channel, so yeah, take care and see you next time.